A new chapter is looming for Marvin's Marvelous Mechanical Museum. The strip mall that's home to the beloved arcade at 14 Mile and Orchard Lake is set to be demolished to make way for a new mire. Last November, when those redevelopment plans were introduced, people packed a Farmington Hills City Council meeting to speak on behalf of Marvin's and keep it from having to move. So now what? Pam Osborne spoke with the owner, and Pam, he says there's only one thing to do. And that is move and keep up with whatever life has thrown his way. This entire complex won't be here a year from now, but Marvin's owner says they will. It's everything in here, the nostalgia and the, just all the antiques and everything are really, really cool. Chris Burgess has been coming to Marvin's Marvelous Mechanical Museum since he was a kid. These days, he drops in with his little girl. I've been bringing her here for about a year now, and she loves it. So it's, it's sad to hear that they're, you know, getting rid of it. With the approval of city council members in Farmington Hills, the Hunter's Square Shopping Center at Orchard Lake in 14 mile will be demolished and replaced with a mire. You know, they call it progress, and progress is good, but it's not good for everyone, unfortunately. Jeremy Yagoda says he's determined to keep what his father started going. And it's so amazing to see how much my dad's vision and his dream and his passion has touched other people that to this extent. I mean, and there's people from all over the world that are sending us messages. But my older ones have a lot of memories here, and they're going to be sad about it. Hopefully not for long. And we're not going to close. I'm too young to retire. I enjoy doing this. It's fun coming to work every day. Yagoda says they have until January of next year to find a new place, and it could take that much time. In the meantime... Thank you for caring. Thank you for trying to do everything that you have. But don't be worried. We'll be back. Now, I did hear from some people that, yes, they can move Marvin's, but will it be the same in a different location? And to that, Jeremy says he's actually thinking about how to make it even bigger and better, including private rooms so they can do birthday parties. So here's what else he says. His dad always had this philosophy about life to make the best out of a bad situation. And so that's what he's going to do. He's going to find a way to find a new place and to make it bigger and better than what it is now, which is already pretty cool. For now, reporting live in Farmington Hills, I'm Pamela Osborne, yeah. Local 4. And keep us posted. All right, Pamela, thank you.